I'm Neil Brown. When disaster strikes your home or business, tell your insurance provider you prefer the restoration company, The Mountaineers Call. Panhandle Cleaning and Restoration. Gnucci back. Looking. Gnucci in trouble and down he goes. Sacked by Ruben Jones, the Michigan transfer, who comes up with his first sack as a Mountaineer. For me, being a Mountaineer is um, it's really one of the most amazing things that uh, I've been able to take to just like in my life. Coming here, um, I didn't know what I was going to run into, um, you know, and I ended up running into uh, Coach Leslie, which is a great D-line coach, one of the best coaches I've ever had. And I came in and um, I don't know, I just kind of like got adopted by the D-line. The D-line just started adopting me like, you know, they was like, okay, well, you know, he's, he's all right, you know what I'm saying? And I guess I just kind of grew him a little bit. I got Reese and I got the Stills brothers, you know, I got Derek Stunte, I got Hefe, I got all of those boys like, you know, to like just, they just kind of like adopted me as a family and it makes me feel, you know, welcome. And it makes me feel good as, as a teammate, you know, that I could bring some, you know, some leadership on the team while also being myself. I also not feel like I'm being judged or like, like somebody's like trying to take me out of my character while, you know, I'm playing football. Five step drop, pressure comes and he's gonna get rolled and sacked on the play. Ruben Jones. I feel like I feel more relaxed when I'm just being myself and I feel like, um, it was a point in time where I was playing football and I didn't feel like myself. And that's when I was like, okay, like, I mean, am I really enjoying the game? And I really realized that I wasn't enjoying the game as much as I'm enjoying it now. And I mean, now, you know, I'm able to just be myself. Like, you know, when I get mad and I want to be mad, I'm mad. Like, you know what I'm saying? If I want to dance and I feel like dancing, I'm a dance. Like, and I just feel like that's just how the game is supposed to be played. The dancing is uh, it's fraternity stuff. It's called hopping. I'm a member of Omega Psi Fraternity Incorporated, and uh, the Q Dogs. I don't know if y'all heard about that. We throw the hooks. You know, we have our tongue out and everything. You know, it's just kind of like a representation of my fraternity. That's just what we do. Like when we get excited, we hop, we march. You know, that's just that's just what it is. Before I became a Q, I don't think I was was as as flexible as I am now. I feel like I'm still progressing, um, but like. Like, I could do stuff that I didn't think I was gonna be able to do. Like, I could do 720 spins and like, I've seen bros like go from jumping in the air to standing on two hands, kicking in the air to spinning and doing backflips and all the different types of like, and that's just kind of like what the fraternity is. And I feel like it does like kind of help you out on the field a little bit. I danced, I danced in high school too, so. You know, I would dance after I get a sack or like dance. Like, I don't know, that's just like the way I just play the game.